Hiya, this is a third lesson, so lesson three, for the transformations pack. So we've got all those different transformations, six of them, and there's no real reason why you can't do them all in one go. But there is an order to doing it, or else if you do it the wrong way, it will slightly change where you draw your graph. Um, so if you actually kind of like do it bit by bit and change it over. So here's our rules for doing it. So for stuff outside the brackets, so like the three and the five, and this example here are both outside of the brackets. So we do, we kind of, so it says here, follow the order of big mass. So you kind of, I write, you kind of write, I do three lots of it, which is that, and then I add five to it, which is that. Uh, now I kind of like, I don't like this wording here. This wording needs to be better. So you can't put a vertical stretch of three, can we? We have to say a stretch parallel to the y-axis. Scale factor three. And then this next one, we have to say translation zero, five, there. Now the ones inside the bracket, you kind of go backwards on it. So you'd think you'd do the three before the five, but you have to do the five first before the three. So you go backwards. So reverse the order. So once again, I don't like this. A translation left by five, it's a translation minus five, zero. And the three is a stretch parallel to the x-axis, scale factor of third. I'm cramming three times as much graph into the same area, so I've got to plot it at a third of the x value. Right. So then it says if you've got a mixture of both, do the inside first. There. Okay. Right. So we'll look at this example. So we'll, nip, we'll keep looking back to this. So what have I got? So I've got to do inside first. So the inside first is just the plus four. So that's a translation. Minus four, zero. Okay. Then I'm going to work on the outside that I normally would do. Now I've actually got two different things there. I've got a stretch and a reflection. So I've got a reflection in the x-axis. And I've got a stretch parallel to the y-axis, scale factor 3. It doesn't matter which order you do them to, they're fine. And then I've got the last one here, which is a translation going down. But I can't put going down for it, I've going down 2. So I have to put 0 minus 2 there. Right, let's have a look. Oh, my word, this one's even worse, look. So I've got the 1 to do first, I've got the 3 to do second, then I've got the two to do, and then I've got the five to do. There. Right then. So I've got the translation one naught. So I'm going to do it for time there. I'm getting the right answer. I've got a stretch parallel to the x-axis, scale factor of third. Then I've got a stretch parallel to the y axis, scale factor 2. Then the last one is my translation. All I needed in there was a, a couple of reflections. Uh, that's 5 down, so it's 0 and minus 5. There. Right. You still with us on that so far? 
Let's have a look at this next one. So how do I go from x squared into that? Well, I've got a slight issue here. And this was a, a similar one was on an exam paper a few years ago. We're not really seeing much like that. So it caught everybody out because where's the vertex? I don't know. Unless, of course, you do completing the square. So if I do completing the square, if I take out minus 2, I've got x squared minus 6x with a plus 4. Then I've got minus 2 lots of x minus 3 squared minus 9. So I've got minus 2 lots of x minus 3 squared plus 18 plus 4 is plus 22. There. Right then. So what have I got here? So I've got a translation. I've got stretch and reflection. Uh, then I've got a translation again. So first one is to deal with a free. So that's a translation. Free zero. Free to the right, do the opposite. Then I've got the reflection in the x-axis. Followed by a stretch, because there's two there, isn't there, number two. Um, parallel to the y. y-axis. Scale back to two. Uh, then I've got the translation of that. For a minute then, I thought my translation at the start should have been a stretch, but it's not. There. There you go. Seven minutes in. Right, let's stop that then, then we can have a look at some of the others.